Do you love buying or wearing customized t-shirt designs like this? Don't worry, because in this video, I'll teach you how to design using Canva. Just watch this tutorial video until the end, so you won't miss any information. It's super easy and free, so what are you waiting for? Let's go! First, open your Canva, then at the bottom, click on Custom Size. Set the width to 4,500 pixels and the height to 5,400 pixels, then click Create New Design. Go to Elements and search for Frame. Click this frame and resize it vertically. Then hold Alt and drag using your mouse to duplicate it. Highlight the two boxes and duplicate them again until you create seven boxes. Go to Elements again, search for Nature Background. Then go to Photos and scroll down. Pick a picture you like, I'll go with this image. Duplicate the selected image. Next, drag the image onto the frame. I started with the center to see the overall look. Double click the image to resize or adjust it. Repeat the process for the other frames and align the images so they connect in the middle. Keep doing this until all seven frames are filled Now, let's add text. Type the letter E and place it at the top. Choose a fun time using Archivo Black. Duplicate it and type the next letters to form the word Explore. Arrange each letter in its position. Once you're satisfied, choose colors. I based mine on the photo colors to match the design. Canva makes it that simple. Next, go to Elements and look for a car with a vector style design. I placed it at the bottom for a unique touch. Always resize your elements at the bottom. You can add more text. I used the great outdoors, and there you have it our first t shirt design. Next, let's add a new page for our second t shirt design. But before we continue with this tutorial, could you please like, share, and subscribe to my channel? Thank you. Now, back to Canva. Add text right away and type say choose a font I selected Anton font. Duplicate the text until you form the phrase say yes to new adventure. Highlight all the text, right click and choose space evenly. Then select align elements to the left, resize the text to fit your design. Go to elements and search for photographer. Select a graphic you like. For this design, I want the photographer to face away from the text. Use flip and select flip horizontal. Add a shape and resize it to fit your layout. Go to Position and drag it down in the Layer section. Choose light colors for the shapes to keep the text readable. Change the color of some text to add variety and style. Duplicate the text and go to Effects, then choose Hollow Effects. Adjust the thickness of the hollow text. Repeat this for the other text.
Once the text is finalized, search for mountain and elements. Select a mountain design you like and position it at the top to balance the overall layout. Lastly, add another image or element to fill the empty space, making sure the design feels complete and visually appealing. And that's it! You now have your second t-shirt design. Next, let's move on to the third design. Add text and type the mountains are calling. Go to Effects and select Curve, position the text towards the top. For this design, let's use the League Spartan font. Go to Elements and search for Mountain again. Resize the mountain image and curve the text around it. Choose a color for the text that complements the design. Next, I'll add a biker graphic in the center. For a minimalist design, I want to add another text at the bottom. I typed and I must go and chose the Amsterdam for font for this part. And there you have it, three customized t-shirt designs. Go to Share, click Download, select PNG file type, click Transparent Background and adjust the size, then Download. If you liked this video tutorial, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and hit the bell button to stay updated with my latest video tutorials.